popularity of open world games makes not just a big company that uses this element to their game, but an indie developer as well. Hello guys, welcome to Simple Spec Games, and today we are going to see the top 15 indie open world games that you can play on PC. Before we jump to the list, make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to get notified for info about indie, pixel, and low-end games. A Hat in Time is a charming platform game where players control Hat Kid, an alien girl, on a quest to recover lost time pieces to return home. The game features open-world environments in four main levels, allowing players to freely explore and collect various items, solve puzzles, and battle enemies using different hats with unique abilities. While it doesn't offer a seamless open world, its level design invites exploration and revisits to uncover hidden secrets and collectibles, creating a sense of freedom and discovery akin to beloved classics like Super Mario 64 and Banjo-Kazooie. Mountain Blade Warband is a medieval action role-playing game that offers a vast open-world experience set in the fictional land of Calradia. Players can explore this expansive world on horseback, encountering various factions, towns, castles, and battlefields. The game emphasizes real-time strategy and sandbox elements, allowing players to recruit and command their own army, engage in large-scale battles, and forge alliances or rivalries with different factions. While the world is not a seamless open world like some modern RPGs, the open-ended nature of exploration and the dynamic interactions with the environment and NPCs create a rich and immersive experience. Wobbly Life is a vibrant, open-world physics sandbox game where players control customizable characters called Wobblies. In this light-hearted and comedic game, Players can explore a vast world filled with wacky adventures, hilarious mishaps, and endless fun. The open-world nature of Wobbly Life allows players to drive vehicles, complete challenges, interact with other characters, and discover mini-games and quests. With its emphasis on multiplayer co-op, friends can join in on the fun thus making it a perfect game for social play. The game encourages creativity and personalization, offering a wide range of customization options for both characters and in-game homes. Alba Wildlife Adventure is a charming open-world adventure game developed by Ustwo Games. Players take on the role of Alba, a young girl visiting her grandparents on the picturesque island of Pinar del Mar. The game focuses on wildlife conservation and exploration, as Alba sets out to photograph various animals and complete tasks to save the island from development. The open-world design allows players to roam freely, discovering hidden areas, interacting with wildlife, and engaging in activities like cleaning up pollution and rescuing animals. Snufkin Melody of Moomin Valley is an enchanting open-world adventure game developed by Hyper Games. Players step into the shoes of Snufkin, the beloved wanderer from Tove Jansen's Moomin series, on a mission to restore the harmony of Moomin Valley. The game combines open-world exploration with musical puzzles, stealth, and environmental challenges. As you traverse the beautifully crafted Nordic landscapes, you'll interact with quirky characters, solve puzzles using Snufkin's harmonica, and work to thwart the park keeper's disruptive plans. Tiny Terry's Turbo Trip is a whimsical open-world adventure game where players step into the shoes of Terry, a teenager with big dreams of launching himself into space using his trusty car. Set in the vibrant and quirky town of Sprinklewater, the game offers a delightful mix of exploration and interaction with its colorful inhabitants. Players can run, drive, and glide through the town, collecting turbo junk and upgrading Terry's car to achieve his space-bound dream. The open-world design of the game is filled with secrets, hilarious characters, and fun activities, ensuring that there's always something new to discover. Kenshi is an open-world survival RPG set in a vast, procedurally-generated desert wasteland 
spanning over 870 square kilometers. Players start by creating a character and must navigate this harsh environment, building bases, upgrading equipment, researching new technologies, and training squads. Players can choose to be anything from a lone wanderer to a mighty warlord, creating their own stories and shaping the world around them. The game emphasizes freedom and creativity, allowing players to interact with various factions, characters, and even entire civilizations, all while managing resources and survival. Little Kitty Big City is a charming adventure game where players control a curious black cat trying to return home after falling from an apartment window. The game is set in a beautifully designed Japanese metropolitan area, brimming with character and detail. Players must navigate this intricate environment filled with various obstacles, friendly animal characters, and hidden secrets. The game emphasizes exploration and light-hearted interactions, where players solve platforming puzzles, interact with other animals, and discover the many nooks and crannies of the neighborhood. The Spirit and the Mouse is a charming narrative adventure game where players take on the role of Lila, a tiny mouse with a big heart. Set in the picturesque French village of saint Clair, players are invited to explore this quaint town at their own pace. Using Lila's unique electricity-based powers, players solve puzzles and assist troubled villagers by completing character-driven quests and charming mini-games. The game emphasizes relaxation and exploration, offering a soothing and heartwarming experience. Abzu is an underwater exploration adventure game that immerses players in the serene beauty of the ocean depths. As a nameless diver, players navigate through stunningly detailed environments, from vibrant coral reefs to mysterious underwater ruins. The game emphasizes freedom of movement and exploration, allowing players to swim at their own pace and discover the rich marine life that inhabits each area. With no combat or traditional objectives, Abzu focuses on creating a calming and meditative experience, enhanced by a captivating orchestral soundtrack. Coral Island is a vibrant and laid-back reimagining of the farm sim genre, set on a tropical island. Players can create their own idyllic farm, live off the land, nurture animals, and build relationships with a diverse cast of townsfolk. The game emphasizes freedom and creativity, allowing players to transform overrun land into a lush and lively dreamscape. The island is full of activities, from exploring the beautiful environments, uncovering hidden treasures, to completing community projects and helping restore coral reefs to their former glory. Players can also find love and friendship among the island's singles, adding a personal touch to their journey. Darkwood is a top-down survival horror game that immerses players in a dark, foreboding forest filled with terrifying creatures and unsettling mysteries. Set in Poland during the late 20th century, the game combines elements of survival, roguelike, and horror genres. Players must explore the forest during the day to gather supplies and fortify their hideout, while avoiding or confronting nightmarish beings that emerge after dark. The game emphasizes freedom and experimentation, allowing players to navigate the world at their own pace and uncover its secrets through exploration and interaction. Darkwood's atmosphere is hauntingly atmospheric, with a focus on creating tension and dread rather than relying on jump scares. Cozy Caravan is an open-world adventure game where players take on the role of a traveling salesperson, journeying through charming towns and idyllic settlements with their trusty caravan and companion, Bubba. The game emphasizes exploration, crafting, and trading, allowing players to gather resources, complete quests, and form lasting bonds with the colorful personalities they encounter along the way. The open world is filled with vibrant locales, bustling communities, and a variety of activities, making each journey unique and engaging. Whether fishing by a lakeside or trading goods in a market, the game offers a cozy and immersive experience.
Sable is an open-world exploration game developed by Shedworks and published by Raw Fury. Players control Sable, a young girl on a coming-of-age journey to find an appropriate mask and return to her nomadic clan. The game is set on the vast desert planet of Midden, filled with ancient ruins and vibrant characters. Sable can customize her hoverbike and clothing, which affects gameplay mechanics like maneuverability and speed. The game emphasizes exploration, simple puzzle solving and discovery, with no combat or set storyline. The Forest is an open-world survival horror game developed by N Night Games. Players take on the role of Eric LeBlanc, the lone survivor of a plane crash, who must navigate a dense, forested peninsula to find his missing son. The game emphasizes survival through crafting, building shelters, and defending against a clan of cannibalistic mutants. Players can explore both the surface and underground caves, encountering various threats and resources along the way. The game features a day-night cycle, adding to the tension and challenge as players must balance resource gathering and base defense. So that is the video, guys. Which one is your favorite? Let me know in the comments. And also, there will be part two for this video. Thank you for watching, guys, and see you in the next video.